but I let Kurt and she had a boyfriend. I was gawky and she was gorgeous and I was hopelessly boring and she was endlessly fascinating. So I walked back to my room and thought if people were rain, I was drizzling and she was a hurricane. That's the mystery, isn't it? Is the labyrinth living or is it dying? Which is he trying to escape? Is he trying to escape the world, or is he trying to escape the end of it? See, that's the thing. Y'all smoke to enjoy it, but I... I smoke to die. Is it so hard to die, Mr. Lewis? Is that labyrinth really any worse than this one? You spent your whole life stuck in the labyrinth thinking about how you'll escape it one day and how awesome it will be and imagining that future keeps you going but you never do it you just use the future to escape the present and then something invisible snapped inside her that we should come together commence to fall apart damn it how will I ever get out of this labyrinth she wasn't even a person anymore but I, I loved her present tense she didn't need to fold into herself and self-destruct. Those awful things are survivable because we are as indestructible as we believe ourselves to be. So I know she forgives me, just as I forgive her. Tom Edison's last words were, It's very beautiful over there. I don't know where there is, but I believe it's somewhere, and I hope it's beautiful. <laughs>